This is Casey Campbell with G1 NBC Sports. We're down here at the Detroit Grand Prix. I'm now here with uh, Tony Buffamonte. Uh, got on the podium for, uh, t for the Trans Am 2 race. Tony, how was the track out there and uh, how are the conditions out there? Uh, track and conditions were great. We were a little nervous about the weather earlier in the day, but uh, the rain held off for us and uh, City of Detroit always puts on a great show for the fans. And so, um, great race out there today. Uh, the number 34 Mike Hope racing car was pretty fast. We uh, got the lead for a little while, unfortunately couldn't hold it. And um, you know, had some cautions there, I think, that disrupted the momentum of the race a little bit. But all in all, pretty good day for us. Uh, how was a, there was a lot of crashes and wrecks out there. Uh, how was a caution-free, uh, caution-filled race? How about that? Yeah, it just disrupts the momentum for sure. And it, uh, you know, we, we want a little more green flag laps, not only for us but for the fans. That, that's for sure. But you know, there's a lot of marbles out there from in the offline from the other series that are running. And so cars that are trying to pass others, um, you know, when you get offline like that, it gets real, real slippery. It's like you're driving on ice. And as you know, there's no room for error with these concrete walls in the streets of Detroit. All right, you guys are going to Indianapolis next. Um, what for the very first time? How's that? How do you get? How's that feel to get to go to Indy? Oh, I love it. Just absolutely love going to Indy. Um, you know, it's a dream of all of us to, to race there and and uh, cross the bricks. We'll be going in a backwards direction, but uh, we'll be crossing the bricks nonetheless, so we're excited to get there. All right, Tony, uh, uh, congratulations and thanks for talking to us today. Thank you.